Can our Jurassic World 4 dinos survive the super glossal Indominus Rex or will they be eaten? Keep watching. Wow, everyone, welcome to Crazy Dino Toys on YouTube. Today we're going to be opening up four brand new Jurassic World Dino Escape Camp Cretaceous Dinosaur Toys, including a Savage Strike Velociraptor, Dino Escape Shilongosaurus, Roar Attack Oranosaurus, and the Wild Pack Heliorhamus. Awesome! And to help us open them up is our colossal custom painted Indominus Rexes. On the left we have the Scorpius Rex. Over here we have Destroyer from Godzilla. Awesome! Let's open these up. It's a Renosaurus vs. Indominus Rex! He just hit put it our Indominus Rex! And he stomped him! What is the Indominus Rex gonna do? He's gonna- Oh no! Ah! There goes our Aranosaurus! He is never coming back! The Geolingosaurus strikes out! Hits the Indominus Rex! With her spikes. I think the only thing she did was pick the boogers right out of the Indominus Rex's nose because she just swallows her right down. And she is gone. Seeing this, Eliramus attacks and jumps right down her throat to try to rescue her friend. So, she's history. And our red raptor comes in, he's jumping up and down like a rabbit, trying to distract the Indominus Rex, but the only thing that happens is she accidentally jumps down her throat now! She's gone. So all four dinos are gone to my favorite Indominus Rex. So we went ahead and fed her. Okay, so the first dino we're gonna unbox is our War Attack Oranosaurus. Uh, if you guys uh, seen Camp Cretaceous uh, Season 3, these are the annoying dinos that keep chasing them, the herbivores that keep trying to stomp the kids to death. With this one you have a head strike. So this is one of the three level ones with sound. And bam, head strike. Okay, that that's not <laughs> it's not really anything. I mean, like I said, I mean I'm not that fond of these three strike ones. I prefer the uh, button ones for attacking. But this is a cool dino. But it is a little annoying that how they just keep chasing the kids, even though they are just herbivores. Okay, so spoiler alert ahead, guys. I do not like Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous Season 4. First of all, nobody gets eaten. Second of all, the majority of the videos are about robot dinos, which I don't like at all. I mean, I, I'm sorry, I, I want my dinos to be flesh and blood, and I want people to get eaten. Come on! Okay, so anyways, like I said, this is a three strike one, so the first one lifts his head partially, second, all the way up, third one, he strikes down, just like they do in the movie, but in the movie they do a lot of standing up on two legs and stomping down, trying to stomp the kids into the ground. So anyways, you know, it's still a cool dino. I just hope they get rid of this three button feature thing soon because it is annoying and it's very hard to make the videos. I mean, these are only good pretty much for posing. Uh, I mean, let me show you what I mean. Like the Indominus Rex, they have the controls on the tail over there. So. 
If you push it, you've got good chopping action. You can keep your hand out of the frame and have this guy attack and chop down the dino. Where this one, I mean, first of all, you're sitting here and going, your hand's very near the action. I mean, it's just, I don't know, it's just its just annoying. Even if your hand was near the action, I mean, if this had the button on the tail or on the back here, they could do that. Okay, that would be a lot. Anyways, so there we have our Aranasaurus. You can see some movement on the tail. The head can be turned a little bit sideways. Other than that, you know, this dino is good for posing. By the way, we will go ahead and add all four of them to our Jurassic World Facts app. I will include the pictures so you can enjoy them too. And then our next one is the Fierce Force Chiang. Chilangosaurus, which is one I have never even heard about. So this one action feature is the swinging tail. So if you pull the tail, the front moves and he swings his spikes. Cool. So let's see. Spike strike. Awesome. And that is our Chilangosaurus free from the package. So let me show you what I mean about Spike Strike. I mean, you can see the front moves and he goes ahead and shoots his spikes out. So you can go ahead and get the Indominus Rex in the mouth right before he gets eaten. But this is an awesome looking dino. I mean, check out this big horn it has coming out of its front legs. Uh, its front legs are much shorter than the rear ones. Again, you've got movement in the front. You can move either the front or the back for an attacking action. And it's green and brown in the front, which is kind of unusual, but I like it. Uh, I'm hoping, you know, with all this weird dinos from, and like saber tooth tiger from the Camp Cretaceous Season 4, that we're going to have a lot more colorful dinos. Such as this Chaos Effect T-Rex from Jurassic Park. So I do hope they come out with a line of Chaos Effect dinos. There is our Chilangosaurus. She is awesome looking. And then we have the Wild Pack, Elioramus. That is a cool looking dino. I love the coloring. I guess it doesn't really have any uh, attack. Uh, I did review the Zunoceratops for you guys, the Herrerasaurus. I have not been able to find the baby Brachiosaurus, which is from Camp Cretaceous Season 4 yet. So there is our Ilyaramus Freep in the package, facing our colossal Indominus Rex, who will be our victor! Uh, that's not really a question, but... <laughs> But, I mean, this Alien Ramus looks awesome. It's got these cool spikes in the front. I love the coloring. I mean, this is like a lighter brown, dark brown, orange, yellow. It's just really cool, vibrant coloring. And that's just an awesome looking dino. Wow. Check her out. She is really cool. And then this is not a Camp Cretaceous one. Uh, this is an earlier one. Uh, I just never had the chance to open this one yet. This is a Savage Strike Velociraptor. It's red and green, which is getting pretty close to Chaos Effect colors, and it looks awesome. So this is one of the ones that have the springing action. I mean, it is a Camp Cretaceous one, but it's not one of the Dino Escape ones. So there we have our awesome Velociraptor with springing action! So basically, she could sit here and spring right into the Indominus Rex's mouth, and she is swallowed right now. 
No, give him, give her back. We haven't reviewed her yet. But anyways, the coloring on this one is awesome. I love it. Red and like neon green, and they even went ahead and painted the uh, claws on the feet, which a lot of these smaller ones they don't. Also, movement on the head, the arms, and the springing action. It, it's a fun feature. I mean, a lot of them have it, but ah, that's one they pulled from the uh, Jurassic Park dinos. The, uh, they had that springing action like. 30 years ago, so there we have it. Awesome red Velociraptor. So instead of Velociraptor blue, this is Velociraptor red. Okay, so it's time to add these to our Jurassic World Facts app. Start it up, hit scan, and scan off my pictures. And there is our Aranosaurus. I love these dino escape ones because you actually get to help the dino to escape. So there she goes with the stomping action. So with this one, 360 view. So it's the toy in 360. And let's get our roar. So they do sound really cool. Just like they do in the show. Okay, let's get some facts on her. I don't know much about her at all. She has a large sail on her back supported by bony spines. She's able to walk on her hind limbs so she could walk two-legged. Her snout is toothless and forms a wide beak. Aranosaurus is an herbivore. Her dorsal sail is for body temperature control or for display. Cool. And then our next one is the Chilangosaurus. I know I'm probably totally pronouncing it wrong. Let me know if I am. Let's get, oh, wait, I was gonna say, no view. So 360 view, there the toy comes to life. I mean that, if you can't afford the toy, I mean download the app, go ahead take that picture. I mean that is the toy with animation. So that is really cool sound. Okay, she sounds awesome. Come on. I like it. And then let's get some facts, because I don't know much about her anyways. She is a close relative of the Stegosaurus. Okay, that's cool. She probably eats firm and cycads. Reaching 13 feet long, she's a small Stegosaurid. Her back has plates on the front half. She has long spikes on the rear half of her tail. Cool. And then we have the Alioramus. Oh, she looks even cooler in the app than she does on the toy. I love it. So there we have a uh, 360 view of her. And then let's get her to roar. Love the roar. That is so cool. I don't know much about her either, so let's get some cool facts. Alioramus juveniles can run faster than adults. She mainly lives in wet regions of Mongolia. She has five bony crests at the top of her snout. She is closely related to the larger Tarbosaurus. Okay, that's cool. She has a greater number of teeth than any other Tyrannosaurids. So she is in the Tyrannosaurid family. And then time for Velociraptor Red! Here we go. First of all, 360 view. She looks awesome. They, gotta, they should switch her on. Uh, instead of Velociraptor Blue, go with Velociraptor Red. <laughs> they gotta add her to Camp Cretaceous. That would be awesome. Get some cool facts. 
A special bone in her wrist allows her to grab prey efficiently. Velociraptors frequently eat sheep-sized proceratops carcasses. She can run over long distances without drinking water. Adult velociraptors are often over six feet long. Velociraptors can jump up to ten feet high. Wow, she'd make a good basketball player. Okay guys, time to check out our collection. So we have 170 dinos. If you've been following me, you have 170 because I include all the scan codes for you guys. Out of the new dino escape ones, we have 32 of them. Wow. So these are the ones we're still missing. So it looks like we're missing about 15 or so. Awesome. Where are you seen this awesome unboxing on Crazy Dino Toys on YouTube? I have a lot more Dinosaur, King Kong, Godzilla, and Jurassic World videos. Go ahead and check them out. Click the subscribe button below this video to see a lot more fun videos. Click the boxes below for a lot more fun videos and if you want to see even more go ahead and click the subscribe button.